so guys um, this is a video on uh, making the pitch lap for my 6 inch telescope mirror it's an f8 so here I am I've uh, poured the pitch already um, into the onto the tool and I've taken a 3 4th inch uh, mild steel flat bar it's about three millimeters thick and I've made the first indentation it shouldn't be in the center it should be slightly off center um, it's ideal if you use uh, a bit of cerium oxide as a lubricant uh, that white stuff you see um, at the edge of the bar is actually cerium oxide some of it is even deposited in the channel that's being made I'm rubbing cerium oxide every time I make an indentation on the pitch it makes it easier it's slightly non-sticky kind of a coating so um, so keep making indentations it should uh, end up looking like you know a bar of chocolate um, dark chocolate I don't like dark chocolates but yeah whatever um, keep the lines straight equally spaced as much as you can I'm not making any measurements if you see I'm just you know quoting and just making an approximation you see the line should not be um, in the center of the tool so basically it should be quite off centered so if you look at the central face it it's not actually in the center um, the center of the tool is off centered in the central face it and that's how it's supposed to be if you read all uh, telescope making journals or books like you know um, the one by uh, Jean Texro um, it should be good um, everyone everyone including you know Stella Fain and all that will uh, tell you that you know it has to be off centered so here I am it's almost done one half is complete um, the other half is almost complete the penultimate uh, channel and one more to go before we actually finish channeling the lap so there we are one last indentation voila my hands fingers are all covered in cerium oxide you see that additional pitch over there you know that will be removed later I'm just coating you know the mirror generously with a thick slurry of cerium oxide don't use thick slurry while polishing this is just so that you know the fresh pitch doesn't stick to the mirror what I'm doing here is or what everybody will tell you is you have to press it's called hot pressing yes I've got a camouflage t-shirt haha <laughs> um, you would ideally press initially by hand but after that you can use uh, you know if you have some counterweights or barbell weights or something at home uh, the pitch should be still soft and easily uh, moldable you, you see some of the facets are already uh, forming onto the surface of the mirror and that's why you see those white squares um, yeah that's the counterweight uh, from my telescope mount that's five kilos um, I'll probably add a one uh, a little later while using a mosquito mesh to make uh, micro channeling and let's uh, catch up in the next video thank you for watching